What's up everyone, welcome back to the fourth episode of Zora Beats Terraria. We're gonna get straight into it again, so enjoy the video. Be sure to hit the like button, subscribe, enjoy it. Okay, so last time we left off, we fought both the Eater of Worlds and the King Slime. If we were to check next on the boss progression, we would be looking at the Torch God. Which isn't too important, so I'm probably just going to go straight to the Desert Scourge, Desert Scourge, I'm going to be honest. Which was one of the things I wanted to do today. I wanted to explore both the Underground Jungle and the Underground Desert, but I guess we're going to do the Jungle first. Uh, desert first, sorry. Uh, so, actually, you know what? Let's just go straight into that, yeah. And actually, there's a... I don't know why I'm going on the left when... Right, when there's literally a desert on the left like so close so i think if i'm to dig somewhere under here i think i'd get into the underground desert so i'm just gonna do that and see what happens or well, maybe not maybe it is on the right side i think there can only be one underground desert in the world i completely overlooked that my bad let's go to the proper underground desert then <laughs> best music in the og game so one thing I'm looking for here is Storm Lion Chargers, I think they're called. Storm Lion Chargers and Desert Fossils, because both of those are helpful. There we go, Storm Lion Mandible, there we go. There's one, I think I need two. I'm not entire. oh shit, a Desert Temple, okay. Wow, we're just... <laughs> okay, we stumble across one, I'm okay with that. This is deep on the ground. I did not expect it to be this deep on the ground. Let's see what we get from it. There we go. Here we go. This is what I'm looking for. So we get gold. Oh, that's nice amounts of gold. 19. Let's go. Okay. A, a sandstorm and a bottle. That's useful for the bundle of balloons that we're going to be getting at some point. I don't know what could be at the bottom of these, actually, if anything. Hey, look, that is some desert fossil that is useful. Uh, so if I play in mind that. Oh yeah, another thing I'm kind of looking for is... Um, what are they called? Sand striders or something like that? Medusa statue, that'll be useful. Oh, a magic conch. That's also useful for making the, um, the shell phone, I think it's called. Awesome. So how many... I only have one. So I guess we just go until we at least find another one. Gravitation potions. We can go to the Sky Islands now. Yes. Good stuff, man. There we go. There's one. I think I think usually what I do is I just sit still and let them come to me, to be honest. Hello. Thank you. That should be enough. Um, ah, yeah, we can also, this guy sells, um, equipment, which will be really useful for making, like, Terra Spark boots and everything. We can actually make those now, I think. I think I need an Aglet of the Wind, though. I need Rocket Boots, actually. I need the Goblin. I need to fight the Goblin Army. I want to do that today as well. I need to remember to do that today. Let's, uh, let's go up to the Sky Islands. This is useful. Massive, um, these, these, like, little islands are just so helpful. Hey, first chest one. Lucky horseshoe, we already have one of those. We can craft those, so those aren't useful. Is this another one? Yes, yeah, another one with a house. Nearly missed that. <laughs> Nearly missed that jump. Another lucky horseshoe. Damn, okay. It may we may have to buy one if we don't find any balloons. Because as it's looking at the moment, we might not get enough. Because I think we need three balloons for each of the bottles. So we might have to spend like what 45 gold 30 maybe. Okay, we're at the sulfuric scene now. That is Leon Fortunate. We have two minutes. Let's try and see if we can get something on the opposite side. Ooh, these are really helpful. These have life fruit, uh, crystals in them. Not life fruits. Nice. 
So one, I think this is the last one that we need actually. Now we are at full health, which means we have maximum damage on our claws and maximum duration on our travel thing. And we get ocean chests too, with some cool items in them. I also need to remember to pick up the uh, chests, two of these. Ooh, we got one last island, nice, okay. I don't, I, don't, I don't know if we'll have the luck to get the other ones. There we go, okay, good. Good, 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 good. We got some paintings in that as well. Let's uh, get rid of some stuff we don't need. Um, and we'll go on to the next island, which is another iron island. See if we can find any on the way down. Probably not. Oh, there was one there. I saw that. Uh, and there was another one up there as well. Bam. Let's store everything back. Let's put down some of the paintings that we got. Also need to put the sky mill here. Okay. Angel statue and the lot. Helpful. Oh, I have enough to make a wall rod as well. That could be useful for, like, th there's a tool that I haven't crafted yet that's useful. But I haven't made it yet, so I don't know what it's like. So, okay, so we, we can get the summon now. Yeah, two. Perfect. So we can get the summon for the desert, um, uh, the desert scourge. We can also craft the summon for Krabulon, um, which we can, we can make, we can make that. I don't know if I'm going to summon him today, um, but we can definitely do that. Let's go, fuck it, let's just go immediately to this and go straight for, go straight for the Desert Scourge. Let's go. Three, two, and one. Look at the shred damage, bro. Holy moly. Oh my god. Holy moly! Got the trophy instantly as well, awesome. As a chance to contain various fishing gear. Fishing stuff is helpful. 50% increased mining speed while wet. Interesting. Let's put that in my loadout too. So, we have Sahara Slices, which don't really do too much from what I'm looking at. Ah, uh, they're just mini, mini things. They do do more damage though. Yeah, do do. Um, okay. So we got more, we got some stuff, we got some good stuff. Um, other than the trophy, we didn't really get all that useful things, I want to say. Um, we got some shells, shells are useful. We got some uh, uh, pearl shards too, those are useful for crafting later on. Other than that, not too much usefulness, which is okay. So some of the other stuff that we can actually get from the Desert Scourge is... The arrow stone, which is good. Uh, we can get the sand cloak, which is 5% movement speed. Cool. But I think that's stealth, so that's for, yeah, that's for rogue. And then the desert scourge for the music box, yeah. So yeah, not, not the best things, not the worst things. We can make our boomerang into the enchanted boomerang. But I'm probably just going to keep with the bat bat for now because it's kind of overpowered. So, you know. I can make the flying carpet though as well. That is a useful movement item. Right, okay. Let's see what we've got next. Giant clam. So that's in the sunken sea. I swear we ran into the sunken sea at some point. If I remember correctly, the Sunken Sea is like somewhere down either the desert or the jungle. I may be remembering this incorrectly though, but what I want to do is I want to create the um, Goblin Battle Standard, which I need, I need tattered cloth. Is there a crafting recipe for cloth? Not tattered cloth. So I pretty much just need to kill goblins, like wandering goblins. Which may be an issue because I don't know how to do that. Yeah, other than that, I think the goblin is just a random chance spawn, which is kind of unfortunate. Mm. Let's see what I can do. 
So, okay, so the next boss is a, the Leapus, which, do we have suspicious looking eggs? I'm not sure we do. We don't. Which is quite unfortunate, actually. And we can't craft it anyway. So I think we get the eggs from drops. Yeah, what I'm probably going to do for now is just craft up all the resources that I got from those uh, islands. Don't really come in helpful, though. So, Kravulon is before the brain and the Eater of Worlds. I could probably kill Kravulon. I'm gonna be real. Fuck it, let's go try it. He might give us something useful. We could also take this all the way down to hell now, probably, which I might do. Okay, here we go. I don't think statue summoned enemies can actually drop anything. Let's try this. Why is he down? Why is he where? Bro, get your ass over here. Oh god, okay, there we go. There we go. Yeah, we pretty much demolish him. Let's see what we got. Bungle Clump, that's useful. That's a healing item, essentially. And then the High Fae Rod. Nothing else of notability, really. But we can't equip it because we don't have extra slots, which is unfortunate. Let's see how far down this uh, elevator is. Pretty far. But I don't want to have this go all the way down to hell, so I'm probably just going to do that really quickly. She spikes. Not that useful, but still fairly useful. Bless me. Another mushroom biome. Interesting. Okay. These, however, are useful. Ooh. Looterang. I do still need an extractinator. One would be very useful. I do need the mod, though, so when I make a, um artificial mushroom biome for the truffle to move. Hmm. Didn't think about that. This thorium might be useful actually, so I do want to use this. Right, into hell territory we go. The traveling merchant. Um, is there anything? Mercer? Mercer from The Walking Dead? <laughs> Ooh. A lab. A Dreadon lab. I haven't looted that yet, but I'll keep that in memory. Okay, we're at hell level now. This is kind of scary. Okay, I didn't get dropped into a big pool of lava, which is good. Oh my god, did I just get a demon scythe instantly? Hold on. I'm gonna try and waste away as many of these bombs as I can. Demon scythe, yeah. Holy crap. Damn. Okay. Oh, god. oh my god. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Am I just getting all the lucky drops? What? Oh, uh, okay. Damn. Thanks, I guess. I'll take it. I don't know what to get rid of. You uh, Harvest to pass, I guess. <laughs> if I get knocked off here, I'm so dead. <laughs> How much hellstone is that? 40. 40 odd. It's not enough. That's 50, actually. I wish this would drain faster. Please. I'm shitting myself. Uh, uh, okay. Bye, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Before I die. <laughs> Hell is a scary place. I'm gonna keep that loot rang on me, because that's quite helpful, actually. Jiminy Christmas, okay. Oh, that wasn't terrifying at all. Enchanted sword? I do want to actually go back down and get the, uh... The obsidian that was down there. Oh yeah, I forgot we have this way of doing it. Wow! Do you want that gilded bat? Get back here, you bastard. Don't run away from me. Don't fucking run away from me! Oh yeah, I forgot there's a traveling merchant NPC. Do you actually sell shit now? No, you don't. I don't know why, but there's a bug with this traveling merchant NPC where it where like he never sells anything. I don't know why. If anyone does know, maybe tell me in the comments below because I have no idea. I have a plan. So now I should be able to make a few pieces of hellstone. Oh, I need a... I can't. I need a forge. 
I'm not gonna get dropped straight into lava, I'm out. Oh, 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 holy moly, mamma mia. Is there anything else I need up here? I don't think so. Hellforge, that's it. Now I should be able to make, yeah, hellstone. Ooh, more gravitation potions, cool. I need those. Um, but for now, I'll craft as many of these as I can, which won't be 25, yeah, it's not gonna be much. But I can now craft the volcano, which is I <laughs> at this point. Like the like the old Lord Claymore is just incredible at this time. Yeah, I think the only notable thing that I can really make as of now is probably the molten pickaxe. Yeah. One boss that we do need to actually kill is Skeletron. I didn't even think about Skeletron. Light instantly. Light's the best modifier for pickaxes. That's incredible. Okay, cool. Yeah, I, I do need to go kill Skeletron. Is there a... Do you, do you sell potions yet for stuff? I need the... Uh, I need this side, right? Yeah. Screw it. Let's do this. Oh my god, we're shredding his hands, bro. What? Look at how much damage we're doing! What? What the frick? Oh my god, we're shredding this dude. Hello? What the hell? Okay, these skulls do a lot to us though. So I gotta be careful for those. Oh, okay. Let's not die. Oh, no! So close. I think the only thing that I need really out of that is buffs, and then I'm fine. I think other than that, I'm fine. Holy, okay. Didn't expect that. Cool. Yeah. Um, not too much in terms of progression in my brain anyway, uh, has been made, but, um, I think I'll end that video off here t for today, guys, I'm gonna be honest. We killed Krabulon, we killed a few people, um, we still need to do the Goblin Army though, which is a big thing I wanna do tomorrow, uh, next episode. So, keep an eye out for that. I appreciate you guys watching these videos. Let me know what you think so far of the series and if you like it or if you want it to be different, more fast paced maybe, less less talk like this and more voiceover maybe. Let me know what you guys think. But uh, hit the like button, subscribe, share with people, and I'll see you all next time. Peace out.